Global Peace Conference began today in Kampala, Uganda. More than a thousand delegates drawn from across the world are participating in the summit. Our reporter Murimi Mwange is there for us. The sixth annual Global Peace Leadership Conference happening here at Munyonyo Commonwealth Resort in Kampala, Uganda. Uganda being the second lucky country in the region to host that particular summit, of course, after Kenya's uh, opportunity in 2010. The focus this time being uh, a moral and innovative leadership for sustainable peace and development. We have got a conflict in South Sudan, a conflict in, 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 in Congo, a conflict in areas of Ethiopia and Somalia and there is a lot of preparation of arms entering into Kenya, entering into Uganda and this curtails the development of the area. What we are doing now as uh, the uh, neighboring countries across our borders will give us a more lasting solution and uh, uh, one thing we did last week, I was in Moroto and I was hosted by uh, uh, my Ugandan counterpart here we also had uh, the South Sudanese uh, ministers coming, uh, representation from Ethiopia. So the four countries basically are working on the Karamoja cluster. This will be the entire UN family delivering as one from both sides on Uganda and Kenya as we are doing with Uganda and Ethiopia coming together in support of the leadership of the two governments in order to make this program happen. And what's exciting was already under the leadership of um, Cabinet Secretary Eugene Mwalwa and uh, the Minister of Karamoja Affairs, a roadmap has been agreed to that over the next two months, we should at least get an MOU signed between the two countries on the Karamoja area. The climax will be tomorrow uh, when uh, the keynote speakers among them, uh, Uganda President Yoweri Museveni, will be addressing the delegates here. Other key leaders from the region attending the summit also being uh, South Sudan President Salva Kir and that of course to uh, mirror the discussions that have been ongoing here, uh, South Sudan has repeatedly been cited as one of the countries in the region that has been facing security challenges and the key speakers in most of the forums here looking at uh, opportunities for the youth and education that can be used to uh, ease the pressure on resources and other causes of conflict in the region. And we presented graciously yesterday to the Deputy President that roadmap and the, I think the government is going to buy that idea, how we can be able to sort them out. But along the, the border of Kenya and Uganda, we need to do something. Why must be the only ones coming to Uganda to look for grass and water? Even we also need to, to, to host them to come for water and grass, isn't it? This is East Africa. From Uganda, the next destination for the Global Peace Leadership Conference will be South Korea in the year 2019. My name is Moremi Mwangi from Kampala, Uganda.